Welcome to this abattoir. This is the place that we normally buy meat from when we go to the village. But this is actually my first time of going there and meeting them where they slaughter the cows. So what I saw, the experience I met there, what I saw there was not good because the place is so dirty. I didn't even know that they used to keep the meat on the ground. They used to keep it on the ground. The place is so dirty and stinky. After visiting this abattoir, I wanted to have double mind of eating meat, honestly. After going there, when you visit this place, you will not even want to eat meat again. So this is the abattoir. Welcome to this abattoir. Um, tell me what you think about it. Tell me if you visited it before. Tell me the one you visited, how it was. Hello guys, good morning and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Lady P. The guys, this is me trying to open this vlog officially. After I'm um, vlogging, I forgot that I did not open it. So, I'm here. It's been days that I did this vlog. So, I'm here to open it officially. Welcome to this vlog. I do hope you enjoy it because it's a village vlog and it's very, very interesting. It is filled with clips here. Yeah. It is filled with clips and in this vlog... I'm going to be seeing me. I'll be visiting the abattoir to go and buy meat. You see the whole things that happen in the abattoir, and um, in my village, in my village, village women meeting, my mother-in-law is their head, their women leader. So every year she used to um do a party for them and cook buy gifts for them, do party for them, so that they use it to close the meeting as a kind of end of the year party. And they use it to organize things and do accounts and all the rest, yes. So in this vlog, I'll be showing you that. I'll be showing you how the women cook. I'll be showing you so many things in this vlog so you don't go anywhere. Sit down, look for something good and chill with it and um, enjoy the vlog. This is oil. I'm going to be using it to rub on this um, pot. This is for rubbing this oil on the pot, please. So that when you're cooking it with firewood, the, the this thing will not stick. The charcoal will not stick to the pot. So that when you just yes, I'm rubbing the oil on the pot at the back of the pot. The essence of rubbing this oil at the back of the pot before you cook is so that the charcoal will not stick on the pot. After rubbing this oil on the pot, some people used to use oil and uh, maybe detergent or whatsoever or even potash. But I'm using only oil so that after cooking with charcoal, after cooking with this firewood, you would and just I use water or little water and little fire. soap and pour on it and everything the magic would just happen everything would just go off so this is the meat i'm going to be cooking i'm going to cook this meat as pepe soup uh, it's it's actually assorted air yeah, it's assorted meat yeah, that's what they call it assorted so i'm going to be using it to cook my pepe soup and i finished washing the meat the meat actually was so big it was big and i Cut, I made it to be small. I cut it small, small. That is me. I'm about to go light my fire. This is how we light fire in my village. This is how we light it. You set your firewood. There is a way you set this firewood and the light will not come up well. Yes, that is just the magic. There is a way you will set this firewood. Your light will not come up well. So, the first step you have to take when you want to cook in the village is to know how to set your firewood. You set your firewood perfect, your light will be perfect. And uh, I'm expert, guys. I am an expert. So that's me setting my firewood now. And after setting it, I'll just pour a little kerosene and light it. The light will just come up. That is what I'm doing now. Just trying to add little kerosene and I'll light my I'll put my light and the magic will start happening. You just watch and see how this magic happens. Ah, of course, your girl is a village girl. I lived in the village for a long time before moving to the city. You see my light? So that, that is the magic, guys. This light, I, because I set the firewood well, this light can stay here like this till my meat 
done till my meat is soft. Yes. Mm. Let's check our food. Wow. Make a hand cash now. I bought potato. 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 They are on my seven leg. Thank you, Okao. Wow, welcome, welcome, welcome to the D Day. This is actually the main day my mother in law is hosting the women. And if you look around, you will see women. The women are everywhere. The women are everywhere. Even at the backyard, there are so many women there doing what they always do. Every year, my mother in law used to organize a party for the women as end of the year party because. He's their leader. He's their women leader. He had, she, oh, sorry. She is their women leader. She has been her, their women leader for eight years now. Yes. One tenor is four years. But after her first tenor, they requested that she go for another one. So this is her second tenor, which is going to end today. And we've really told her to stop this thing. We've told her to... Quit, quit being this leader because this thing can be so stressful. My mother-in-law don't have time of her own. If you dare her to visit you, she would say, I have a meeting to attend, I have this, I have that. So we've actually told her to stop being their leader. So these are the women. These are the women proper. This is how they do it. They will be in their women uniform. They will all be shining. Can you imagine? Can you see how these women are? This is how they do it, and everyone will just gather you do your complete uniform and they will do their meeting. If there is anyone that commits an offense, it will be treated that day. See that woman at the middle? Yes, she's an offender. <laughs> she committed the offense, and they are treating her, they are judging her, they are looking into her, um, her case. They are looking into her case. She's trying to explain how everything happened. And they are looking into her case. So this woman now cheering them up is actually cheering them up so that they will stop the noise. <laughs> women are noise. To, to, to be a leader of women is not easy. To even be in women organization is not easy. Because women, they like noise. They can make noise. They can make noise. So after cheering them up, the woman continued with her explanation. So that's what she's doing now. And if you look, if you look down there, you will see the men that they're drinking. Why they actually called the men is because when they are having conflicts like this, they normally call the men to come help put mouth in the matter. The men actually comes around. The men will serve as their judge. The men will serve as their judge. Will ask what the problem is, and they will serve as their judge and say to the matter amicably. Yes, the women, our women, we actually call the men and um, we buy drinks for them, cook food for them. And after eating and drinking, we will now tell them why we call them. The people that are, the offenders will just come up and the men will ask them some questions and the men will judge the whole thing. And after everything, the men will give advice. This man standing here is actually a chief. Yeah, he's a chief and he is trying to give advice to the women. That is how they do it every year. Guys, I hope you do enjoy this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. And you are free to ask me any question on the comment section. I will answer you honestly. Ask me any question that you wish to ask me or anything that confuses you just ask me down on the comment section i will really really be glad to answer you thank you thank you so much my people thank you so much my lovers for watching this video please give it a thumbs up share this video please it means a lot to me share it and comment i really want to read your comments i want to read your comments keep, keep your comments down below i will really be glad to read your comment and share this video tell me what you want to tell me ask me any question you want to ask me and share your own experience how your women meeting used to be 
and let's really have a discussion class thank you so much thank you so much once again for watching this video and if this is your first time of being here please please do well to subscribe subscribe to this amazing channel i promise you are not gonna regret it you will never regret it thank you once again for watching i will see you in my next video